Hey, what's going on everyone? Welcome to the Nine Miles Review of the As Seen on TV Ice Cream Magic. Makes ice cream in three minutes. Personal ice cream maker. Uh, if you like my content, please support it. Patreon.com slash Nine Miles or just search Patreon for Nine Miles. Like I've mentioned in previous videos, uh, I'm just looking for 1% of my audience to contribute $1 a month. That's it. And if that's the case, that'd be awesome. So, appreciate that. And now on to the review. So, it's just a little cup, and let's turn on the back. So I, I watched the video on this uh, before making this review, and all you have to do is you put in salt, uh, ice, and cream, and just flavoring. And in the video they use chocolate syrup. I'm gonna use some vanilla. So I'm gonna make some vanilla ice cream. See if it actually works. If it does, I'll be very impressed, actually. Okay, so inside the box we have the cup. And it's metal right there. And then plastic on the bottom has a rubber kind of ring around the edge. You have a little ice cream scooper spoon, a cover, uh, consumer rights, and you have the instruction booklet. So let's just see what the recipe is and test it out. All right, so remove the cover lid. This is the cover lid. Fill the ice uh, chamber with ice. And this is the ice chamber. Add four tablespoons table salt. Add four tablespoons water. Place the freezing bowl over the ice changer, or chamber. Uh, actually, no. The ice chamber is down below. And that's what you fill up. And then, uh, so you add the four tablespoons water. Place the freezing bowl over the ice changer chamber. Add ice cream ingredients to the fill, uh, fill bowl right here. Firmly place ingredients over freezing bowl. Be sure lid is secure. Uh, twist the, the cover lid closed and shake continuously for three minutes. All right, so I'm gonna put in all the ingredients and test it out. And it actually, you know, looking at it, it seems like it might actually work. So let's see if it actually does. All right, so here we go. We have all the ingredients, and I'm going to add the ice here. And just fill it up to the fill line in the cup. And I'm just using kind of smaller pieces because I want to put on this cap and have these big, big chunky ice. So it doesn't take much to kind of fill it up um, completely and I'll, I'll kind of uh, push it down with a you know ice pick or something all right so next we have the salt so four tablespoons salt and just table salt one two Three and four, and now four tablespoons water. So we got one, two, three, and these aren't full tablespoons, so I'm gonna add a, just a little bit more. All right, that's about that's about four tablespoons. Okay. And now it's kind of melting down, so this goes on a little bit better. All right. Okay, I'm gonna kind of push it down a little bit. All right, that works. So now it's kind of a salt water brine in there. Okay, so next, we put the freezing bowl chamber on top. We add the ice cream ingredients, which is just pretty simple. We're gonna add the cream here, kind of up the, to the fill line, and some vanilla. And I'm just using the imitation vanilla. You might wanna use the natural stuff. All right, just gonna stir that up a bit, get that in there. All right, so next I'm gonna add a little bit of sugar. All right, 
There we go, some sugar in there. Just stir it. All right. So there we go, it's all ready. And I'm gonna put on this cap and then put the plastic piece and it kind of just locks into place. You turn it, just locks into place. And next, I'm gonna shake this for three minutes. And I'm just gonna start shaking. And you know, you can feel it and it's really, really cold. The salt makes it even cooler. So I'm just gonna shake this for three minutes and see how it turns out. See if it actually makes ice cream. So I've been shaking the ice cream maker, ice cream magic for about three minutes and a little bit over three minutes actually. And I'm gonna open it up and see the results. Did it actually make ice cream? And look at that. So it's definitely not completely frozen. The bottom is, the bottom is definitely frozen. And the sides are, anything around the metal, you can see that it's frozen, look at that. All right, let me taste this. And it's really, really good. I mean, you definitely can't go wrong with, you know, cream, sugar, and vanilla. So yeah, even in the direction that says, after three minutes, stir ingredients. If consistency is not to your liking, shake for an additional minute or so. So, um, so yeah, it's definitely gonna need more time. I think if you kind of stir it, kind of get it around the metal surface, you know, it might freeze faster. But uh, yeah, so, didn't work in three minutes. And so, uh, you know, maybe it's the ice that I'm using, who knows, because the cubes are a little bit larger. It might work better with smaller ice. But follow the directions and didn't make it in three minutes. So uh, yeah, but it, it definitely would freeze it. The more, the more you shake it, the more it's gonna be, it's gonna freeze. And uh, so it, it does work that way. So kind of on the fence with this product. And um, I think you're gonna have better results with just getting an ice cream maker. So uh, this thing costs about seven, you know, dollars, seven, eight dollars online. I think you should just save your money. Ice cream makers aren't that expensive. So get a tested design one that's well reviewed, just get an ice cream maker, you're gonna be a lot happier with the results. 